All right. Hello. Welcome to episode, uh, what is it, nine? I think I'm up to nine of my Minecraft tutorial series. Dadding my way through Minecraft here. Thank you for all the folks who are following along, watching along. Thanks to my buddy Tim. Special mention for Tim for uh, being a big fan and a good friend watching me play Minecraft. <laughs> um, so, started work on a house here. Thought I'd continue work on the, on the house. We can get out of the living in the basement, so to speak, in the in the uh, side of the mountain. What we're going to need going forward here is lots and lots of wood. So, I think what I'll do, just try it for this episode, is uh, I'm going to go... Oops, not going to go into the menu. That would be silly. Uh, I'm going to go find some trees and... Man, there's a real shortage. I picked a... Let's run over here. What I should have done is probably grabbed, made another axe, since I just have the one, I think, with me. Let's just go tree sh chopping crazy. And, uh, yeah. I picked an area. Interesting. Oh, not that interesting. <laughs> I thought there was going to be a big tunnel there. I seem to pick an area where there is a lack of forest. There's uh, the different areas that are in Minecraft, the different uh, sort of types of areas you're, you can be in, called biomes. So kind of like just like the real world where certain types of uh, geographic things, <laughs> geology, earthy things, ouch, jump from too high. We'll hear more in one area than another, not in another. So, you know, there's snow areas, snow covered areas, um, water areas, obviously, more mountainous regions, more. I don't, yeah, I don't, obviously don't know all the details of it. But what's important about it is and you'll, you'll figure it out as you're running around in the world. You'll change from one area type to another. And, um, but what's interesting, important about that is that uh, there is a new version of Minecraft that's coming, uh, version 1.7, I believe, if I have my numbers correct. And uh, that is going to add a bunch of new sort of variations on some of the biomes that are out there. So it'll just kind of change the look of the game. So even uh, something as simple as, you know, watching this game, and uh, you'll be able to upgrade your games. Um, I'm going to just climb up this mountain here, see if I can see. See what I can see from the top of a mountain. Uh, there are some big trees over there. Don't really like getting too far away from my home base, but uh, got to do what you got to do. Um, so yeah, they'll it'll just change the look and feel of uh, certain areas and uh, add some a bunch of new features. There's things like changing. Hey, lots of pigs over here. Lots uh, adding things like uh, stained glass. So right now you can. You'll be able, or in version 1.7, you'll be able to color and stain your glass, glass things that you can make, windows, um, which we'll show you on the house that we're going to make. Ah, the pig's jumping in the trees. Perfect. Um, where are we here? You can climb vines and things like that. Uh, getting lost in the bushes here. There it is. Oops. <laughs> Pardon me. Let me just get my shit out. Get up here. All right. Here we go. Lots of trees. See, so just one biome over basically is likely what's going on here. And there's probably a technical name that's more familiar than Minecraft players are shaking their heads as to why I'm not calling it whatever it's supposed to be called. But uh, such is life when you're dealing with a newbie dad playing Minecraft. So you can all be like, oh, dad. Even, oh, that's a little creepy. Anyway, you get the idea. This is likely some sort of swampy area with lots of big trees. So, getting... Let me just check my inventory here. Oh, right, we're in jungle, because this is jungle wood. The other stuff we had was oak wood. 
it all works the same. It just looks different uh, when you're building with it. So, or it can't look different. I'm in efficiency mode, trying to grab as much wood as possible. fallen. So something you can do, like we've I sort of said before, is well if you're away from your crafting area. Yeah, this is actually gonna give me lots of wood. You could build another crafting table and then so if I wanted to say for example build another um, pickaxe or yeah another axe sorry and but use stone instead of a dun, dun, there you go Stone axe, which will work better and quicker. Should have built an iron one. I have some iron back at the old chateau. And then you just break it down and take it with you. Because you'll uh, definitely need need uh, crafting tables all over the place, so don't worry about making one and thinking you don't need it right away. It's kind of a handy thing to carry with you. I think this is probably enough wood. This is obviously quite a bit of wood in, in this area here, so... Definitely have to come back here as I need more. Excitement of chopping wood is overwhelming you, I am sure. And what should be overwhelming you is whether Chris will be able to find his way back. Yeah, exactly. Without dying. Here's the pig sanctuary, as we shall call it. So on the computer, anyways, hold the space bar. That'll get you uh, swimming up. I'm just going to chow down on some steak. Pardon me while I chew with my mouth open. Um, let's run so we can get some stuff done here. Maybe I'll speed this part up. All right, so we're back. I'm gonna throw my crafting table down here and here's what we're gonna do. Convert this all to oak wood planks and jungle wood planks. So, jungle wood plank right there. Oak wood plank, you can see just a slight shade different. So you can be as picky as you want, obviously, with this kind of stuff. Chop it up and it goes right back to being an oak wood plank or a jungle wood plank, whatever it happened to be before. No big surprise there. And I need to do some organizing here. So, uh, well, it's getting to be dark. Let's head back for, that was a good day of chopping wood. Let's just head back, double tap on your direction that you're headed to run. And we'll have a quick snooze. Ah, there we go. Quick night of sleep. Oh, sounds like a skeleton's dying somewhere. OK, 
can't see him, but he's out there somewhere. Anyways. Only reason it's of, of note, I guess, is that it's kind of... Uh, I'm just going to get rid of that. Um, good to go collect whatever they happen to drop, if they do. Or go get it. One last shot on them while they burn up. And uh, Okay, so what do we need here? We need um, a roof. We need a uh, doors, which we've made doors before, so maybe I'll just quickly do that. We haven't made a double door. Uh, right click on the crafting table. Let's use, can you move stone? I forget now. No. <laughs> if I can. So that'll give you one door. Do it all again. Gives me two doors. And so I can plop a door down right there and then grab the other one and plop it down there. That gives me a nice sort of double door look. Right click, each one opens independently, but just like that. Instant, instantly lock out, keep out any bad guys because they cannot come through the door. They haven't figured it out, luckily for us. So I'm gonna put some dirt down here just so I can get up on top of the old building. What was I doing here now? On the corners. I should put this, uh, put some stone. I should probably do the the bottom one too. See, so the stuff doesn't drop, obviously. It stays there. Yeah, that looks like a nice little uh, corner on the old house. Plop another one up there. Plop is the technical term construction workers use, as you probably are familiar with. I'll have to replace the bottom. I have a general idea of what I'm wanting to do here, but uh, haven't actually sketched it out in my head or kind of, you know, practiced it ahead of time. So, if things look a little bit weird, you can always fix it. Fix it in post, as they say in the audio biz. Plop that down. Perfect. Okay, so we got the corners. You don't actually have to keep closing the door. That's an old habit I have. <laughs> uh, obviously, at nighttime you want to keep it closed so that monsters don't venture in. But uh, so let's. Uh, oh, I'm on jungle wood. How much jungle wood do I have? Let's use jungle wood for our roof line here. Start of our roof line. Oops, that's not what I wanted. See, it takes a little longer if you don't use the right tools. So I'm going to start the roof here and doing one important, oops. So the way you can sort of get over that is by connecting with, yeah, that, like an, uh, across on the other side. Okay, so that's the start of the roof line. And uh, for decoration, what we're gonna do is use uh, stairs actually, except, let's see, what do I have lots of? I'll use these. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, so we're going to make some stairs, which, uh, some nice jungle wood stairs. And, sixteen of them, sure. Start with that. Get those into my hands, my grubby little hands. So just for an example, let's see how this looks. Oops. Oh no. I have to do it on the top. I think. Stick another piece of dirt down. So I jump and plant it. Chop that guy. Oops. Wrong tool. Like I've said, only, the <laughs> only a tool uses the wrong tool for the job. Oops. That went the wrong way again. I know what I'm doing wrong. It has to go on here. Jungle wood planks. Jungle wood planks. We'll go one more here. Whoops. <sighs> Ouch. That's what I'm after, right? 
need some scaffolding here. Actually, maybe I should. Uh, here's what I'm going to do. See this? Jeez, did it again. Go right here. Dunk. Oh. What's my problem? Well, that could work, work too. Let's just try this. Work with it. Work with me, people. We're going to leave the corners uh, as they are. Obviously, I'm going to need some more here. This is purely uh, decoration, obviously. not Nothing is required as far as this kind of thing. Oops, not L64. There we go. So why is that? Let's see here. Yeah, just the angle that you're plopping them up there at. Plopping again, technical term. Oops. Will affect which way that they face. Oh, we need one more. Oh, there's one that I dropped. Perfect. Okay, so that gives us a little fun, what's that called? Some woodworking person can inform me. Uh, and then we're going to build a whole bunch of, not a whole bunch, of these, which are called, oh, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Is a jungle wood slab, which sounds like a fun dance party. Uh, plop that up on the corners. Something like that. That gives you... Whoops. Luckily, in Minecraft, it's very easy to undo. Because you just mine it away. Okay, so that's the start for the day. I think that's uh, it's about 20 minutes here. Maybe a little bit shy this morning. I have to run out, so um, pick up any lost pieces. But uh, that's we're get start getting started anyways on our roof line. It will come together in a much nicer way here very soon. So take a look upon the handiwork, and I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.